This is Brad from Attitude RC. Um, I just got, well, not too long ago, I put a brushless kit in my Nano CPX. I don't know if you can see the brushless motor in there. Um, and the batteries I had for it just weren't enough. And what I had was the regular E-Flight um, 150 milliamp hour 45C batteries. And they just weren't cutting it. They just weren't. It, it would actually go low voltage when I uh, when I was doing hard punch outs, um, and shut down and just drop right out of the sky. So, what I did was I went looking for a little bigger battery, not too much bigger, and I found this. And this is the Charson um, 250 milliamp 1S. A battery and it has the same plug as used for everything else they actually I bought this in a five pack and it's um, it's rated at 30 to 60 C and a five pack 1699 for five of these which isn't too bad or you can buy them um, separately for 429 each but why pay for the shipping twice um, so you can get five pack for 1699 um, it works perfect in the nano CPX uh, you can see the size difference between the two. I'll just line them up perfect. You can see the size difference between the two. I mean, it is bigger, but moving it around in the heli, you can uh, adjust the center of gravity, so it's, it seems to be okay. And um, just to show you, it slides in really nice. I'll just pop this in right here for you. Get that out of the way. And... It's just a little bit tight getting in, but it goes in just fine. And what I did was I just set it back. Instead of pushing it all the way forward, I just set it back maybe not even a quarter inch, half inch, quarter inch, about a quarter inch. I set it back, and um, it, it seems to balance out just, just perfect. And um, I'm going to have some flight video here for you in a little bit, and I'll do a comparison on the two two batteries and you can see where it goes low voltage and just shuts off and drops out of the sky um, but yeah it, it seems to fit there's about a two gram difference between the two um, which with this brushless motor that won't will not make a difference so um, it might fly a little heavier but I doubt it because this brushless motor makes a ton of power so a uh, nice little addition to the heli um, and like I said, uh, you can get them in a five pack, uh, relatively inexpensive, $16.99 for five of them. And you can see they, I mean, they match up pretty decent, just a little bit bigger. Uh, but you get the 250 milliamps, and so you get an extra 100 milliamps. And hopefully that'll give me enough punch to do, um, to good, do, do good punch outs and uh, without going in a low voltage situation and shutting down. Okay, it's a little windy for this today, but I'm gonna do it anyways. Um, this is the stock 45C 150 milliamp battery. And I'm just gonna spin it up here. And it you know, flies okay, but as soon as you get it in idle up and really start putting some pitch into it, you can hear it bogging pretty bad. Kick some pitch. Gives you a couple minutes of flight time. I'll shut down here shortly. And then I'm gonna throw some pitch into it and it'll probably shut down. There it goes. And basically what it is is batteries are just tired. They're old and they don't have enough output. And so when you really put some power into them, uh, when you really draw some power, the voltage goes low and the speed control does this low voltage cutoff. I'm going to switch batteries and we'll see how it flies from there. Okay, here's the new battery. Wind is crazy. Idle up. And this is where it shuts down on the 
on the smaller batteries. Oh, and this has got plenty of power. It's actually kicking the tail out when I do a hard punch out. Oh, this has plenty of power. Oh, I'm liking this already. $16.99 for five of these. Bargain. Fighting the wind a little bit, but that's okay. <laughs> Trying to keep it from... Has no problem dealing with the wind with this battery. And I'm just doing some hover because I really haven't broke these batteries in yet. So we're just being light with them, although we're just having some fun fighting the wind here. Doesn't matter how much collective I put into it. The only problem I'm having is the tail blown out. This battery's got tons of power. I was getting out of the smaller batteries two minute play times. Probably get five out of this. This is a whole new heli with this new battery. It flies great. Um, the batteries have really good performance. I've been flying this one for about five minutes and uh, it was just starting to get a little tired and granted I was only doing some light hovering I wasn't really throwing it around but um, really nice battery I like it a lot I'm probably gonna order another five and I'm probably gonna pack it in for today because it's just too windy to fly this is Brad at Attitude RC thanks